This guide will help you resolve the Call of Duty Black Ops 6 error code 0x00013382488. The application unexpectedly stopped working. Click on the taskbar icon. Right-click the Vanguard icon. Select Exit Vanguard. Now launch your game. First open a folder. Open Documents. Delete the Call of Duty folder. Now launch your game. Now launch your game. If you use Steam, right-click Call of Duty. Select Properties. Select Installed Files. Click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. Now wait for Call of Duty to be repaired. First log out from Steam. Right-click your Steam shortcut. Select Open File Location. Right-click the Steam shortcut again. Select Open File Location. Locate your Steam executable and right-click it. Select Properties. Open the Compatibility tab. Uncheck Run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8. Press Apply and then OK. Now run your game. First open the Start menu and type Graphic Settings. Open Graphic Settings. If you use the Xbox app, select Microsoft Store app. Press Browse. Select Call of Duty. Press Options. Now select High Performance and press Save. Now launch your game. If you use Steam, right-click Call of Duty. Select Properties. Open Installed Files. Press Browse. This will be the location of your COD executable. Now that you know the location, open the Start menu and type Graphics Settings. Open Graphics Settings. Select the Desktop app and press Browse. Now look for your COD executable. Double-click on your COD executable to add it. Press Options. Select High Performance. Press Save. If you use Battle.net just do the same thing. First press the Windows key plus R. Type devmgmt.msc and then press OK. Expand Display Adapters. Right-click your display adapter. Select Properties. Go to the Driver tab. Click on Update Driver. Click on Search Automatically for Driver Software. Wait for the update to be installed. You can also click on Search for updated drivers on Windows Update. First, Google GeForce Experience. Click on GeForce Experience. Press Download Now. Save the file. Run the installer. Press Yes.
Now install the program. First open Call of Duty. Click on the three dots. Click on Manage. Click on Files. Click on Change Drive. Now move your game to another drive. If you use Steam or Battle.net do the same, go to Options and move the game to another drive. First open the link that you will find in the description of this video. Click on downloadable version. Click on download the gaming services repair tool for PC. Wait for the repair to be downloaded. Right click the tool and select run administrator. Select Yes. Now wait for the tool to repair your Xbox app. If the tool worked, then type Y and then press Enter. First, open the Start menu. Type PowerShell. Press Run as Administrator. Press Yes. Copy the first command that you will find in the description of this video. Right-click the PowerShell frame and select Edit. Select Paste. Now press Enter to uninstall gaming services. Copy the second command that you will find in the description of this video. Right-click PowerShell and select Edit. Click on Paste. Now press Enter. Press Get to download gaming services. Press Yes. Wait for gaming services to be downloaded and installed. Now gaming services should be installed. Type exit and then press enter. First open the link that you will find in the description of this video. Click on downloadable version. Click on Download the Gaming Services Repair Tool for PC. Wait for the repair to be downloaded. Right-click the tool and select Run Administrator. Select Yes. Now wait for the tool to repair your Xbox app. If the tool worked, then type Y and then press Enter. First open your Start menu and type GeForce Experience. Open GeForce Experience. Click on Call of Duty. Press Optimize. Now launch your game.
Select Call of Duty. Click on the three dots. Select Manage. Open the Files tab. Select Verify and Repair. Choosing to verify and repair your files will reset Call of Duty Black Ops 6 to its original settings. You won't retain any mod files and game saves that aren't backed up may also be lost. Press Yes. Now wait for Call of Duty Black Ops 6 to be scanned for errors. Now launch Call of Duty.